I am Pietro Andreone from the University of uh, Bologna, Italy. And uh, I am uh, here to present about uh, a study evaluating the efficacy of uh, treatment with antivirals in subjects with uh, chronic hepatitis C. The study uh, uh, is named uh, PEARL2 and uh, included uh, three direct uh, antiviral drugs with or without uh, ribavirin. The three drugs uh, are 4-5-O-ABT, that is a protease inhibitor, uh, Ombitasvir, that uh, is a NS5A inhibitor, and Dazabuvir, that is a NS5B non-nucleoside polymerase inhibitor. Uh, this study was uh, performed in 186 subjects with chronic hepatitis C receiving a 12 months treatment. The key inclusion criteria were age between 18 and 70 years, the absence of cirrhosis and a previous non-response to pegylated interferon and ribavirin. The key exclusion criteria were co-infection with uh, HIV or HBV and uh, genotype different from 1B. The Efficacy and point were sustained virological response 12 months after stopping treatment. Non inferiority and superiority sustained virological response compared to an historical control group of subject treated with telaprevir, pegylated interferon, and ribavirin. The safety endpoints were uh, evaluation of hemoglobin decrease, adverse events, and laboratory abnormalities. The evaluation of uh, safety endpoints was performed in all patients included in the study. While the intention to treat analysis of efficacy was performed in uh, um, 91 subjects enrolled in the uh, group uh, um, combined with ribavirin and 95 of patients enrolled in the arm without ribavirin. Uh, seven patients were uh, not eligible for uh, efficacy because in six cases the patients uh, not received a co-formulated regimen with uh, ABT450 co-dosed with retonavir and uh, ombitasvir but were utilized uh, the subject uh, for the safety analysis. Concerning the results, the sustained virological response was obtained in 96.6% of the subject receiving the ribavirin, while in the arm without ribavirin, the SVR was 100%. Um, about uh, the non-inferiority and superiority in both arms, this endpoint was reached 
compared to the group of historical controls treated with uh, telaprevir, peg interferon, and ribavirin. No one patient experienced a virological failure during or after stopping the treatment. Concerning adverse events, they were more frequent in subjects treated with uh, ribavirin and, in particular, insomnia, asthenia, nausea, and anemia were significantly higher in this group compared to the arm treated without ribavirin. Concerning the anemia, only two patients treated in the arm with ribavirin reach a level of hemoglobin below 10 grams for the cilter. No patients reached this endpoint in the group treated without ribavirin. About, uh, uh, about bilirubin, a uh, three time increase uh, was seen only in eight patients treated with ribavirin, while no patients treated in the arm without ribav uh, ribavirin were uh, uh, reaching this uh, um, uh, increase of bilirubin. In conclusion, dear colleagues, a uh, three direct antiviral agents regimen without uh, ribavirin uh, is uh, an optimal treatment efficacy in subject with uh, genotype 1B, no cirrhosis, and uh, previous known response to pegylated interferon and ribavirin. Thank you for your attention.